Okay, in this video we're going to see if I can beat Crash Bandicoot without dying. So watch till the end to find out and like and subscribe. Okay, so today we're going to play Crash Bandicoot the whole game without dying and I'm going to prove that I can do it. Alright, there we are, the first level. I don't even know why I picked up the lives, you know, we don't really need them. And don't question how I already lost one Akumas because we, we were already supposed to have three at this point. There we go, there's the ending. And we beaten it, you know, we didn't get all the boxes but luckily that doesn't matter. Alright, level two, now we can get uh, whatever this super uka uka thingy is. And if you've been catching up with my channel lately, you, you, you could have been seeing that um I've, I'm, I've been trying to complete this game without dying you know i've been i've been streaming this a lot but then i was like why not make it a video as well where i try to beat it without dying and so far it's uh, it's been going pretty well you know two levels already all right this level i usually um you know i don't really like this one but we're going to do well so yeah uh, you know anyway i'm going to tell you about something i've been working on lately and um, i really hate the idea of promoting something like this but um i've been working I'm making merch and I did one design. Alright, sorry for that, I had to get to the next level. But yeah, I made one design so far and it looks pretty silly. And I'll leave a link down in the description if you want to check it out. I um, mean, you obviously don't have to buy it uh, because like, I don't think you want to be caught wearing that. Ooh, we got a gem, you know. Ooh, I didn't even die. That, that, wait, no, obviously I didn't die, that's what this whole video is about. And now I lost all my ukas. Anyway, I only did like a simple merch design because I was still like trying out how everything works. So, you know, I wasn't going to um, spend too much time on something if it wasn't going to work. Because that would be a waste of time. And ooh, we completed upstream. Is it, is it even called upstream? <laughs> no, look, it's Papu Papu. That's like the easiest boss fight I've ever witnessed. You know, all you gotta do is jump on his back and... You defeated him. And the thing I noticed about Papu Papu is, why does he only have four toes on each foot? And not only that, he only has four fingers on each hand. And ah! Do I even pick up this mask? Because it's caused more trouble for me in like the past than it has done good. Like I'm not even joking. I probably died more on a level like this than I did on like Sunset Feaster. I know we're on Hog World. Only two more levels and then we can already go to the next island. And can we just appreciate how this is literally like one of the best like maybe even the best remake ever like you know games be getting remakes and all but i think crash bandicoot insane trilogy is definitely the best like game that's a remake although if you know a better remake definitely let me know now did i miss a book native forest more like you know you know for a game that's supposed to be really hard this is actually quite relaxing and um, if you're new to this channel um, I, I recently just completed a Crash Bandicoot 4 and it was a horrible experience because that game was so hard. Like the longer I played it, the, it felt like it became less enjoyable because of its difficulty. But you know, this one's uh, really fun despite being so hard. And we're going to skip through this entire level, you know, just like that. And ooh, we're on the next island. And why do I have a big Uka Uka mask right now? I, I the, the, the hitboxes and like... Uh, you know, this level is not fun. Like, this level feels like driving on the highway in first gear. You know, this, f this, f this, this, bro. I made it, either way. <laughs> and no way, it's Ripper Root. This is my favorite boss fight. And please blow up, yes! <laughs> I did it, that's insane. Now, but to be honest, that previous level felt like as if you ordered a vinyl from Amazon, but they delivered your package like they folded it. And I think we got, a, uh, we got him right now, yes! Yes, we did it! That is amazing. And anyway, now he's going to fall in the water. Goodbye. And anyway, we're on the Lost City, and let's not go for the shortcut, because I already know that will go terribly wrong. You know, I already completed the game once, it's not worth it. And the amount of times I died on this level is crazy, so I know this level by heart. And I really can't slip up right now, because, um... That would mean I am dead. Since you know, I know. Ah! Since you know, I kind of um, lo lost my Aku mask, you know. Now, you know, when doing this on a normal video, I'm performing way better because every time I live stream and do this, there's this guy in chat named Martin and he's always giving me performance anxiety. And ooh, we made it at the end without dying. And Crash is going to break his back at this point. Someone's going to have to check up on him and maybe call 911 because he needs a hospital right now. Ooh, you want to know a secret? Look at this. Wow, that was the biggest waste of time yet. And no, you know, you most definitely got to watch out with a fire like that. I knew we're almost at the ending, and of course they put this extra section here. I knew we made it. Uh, you know, oh, wait, I'm going to tell you in the next level. All right, so you all saw that jump at the end, right? Because in, in like my first playthrough, I died at the last jump, and so far I've wasted all my Aku Aku mask. 
on those pigs and like I, I just don't know how to get rid of the pigs like whoever put the pigs in the game it, like they're, they're the only things making this level hard good thing we made it through without dying you know this was pretty easy a new boulder dash again and oh no i just realized i have an assignment due to monday and like it, it, it how am i going to do that well first i have to complete crash bandicoot before i can even work on that gaming is way more important you know you've got 10 year olds skipping school for fortnite and they're the reason i can't i can't get any crown victories anymore so i can't be that bad here i see i'm doing okay i might sound a bit different right now and that is because um i have my headset wired right now now you know my headset died so uh that, that's usually that's not a good thing. Also, in between the time of the last level and this one, it's probably like a few hours because um, I did the assignment that um, I told about. And um, it wasn't too hard, it was just some uh, photography stuff. And um, usually I die a lot in this level, but right now uh, things have been going pretty well. But like this this level, this is my weak spot. Like, you know, this is where things go so bad. But how do I get higher? I swear, I can never make that jump. Okay, I finally made it. Okay, I'm never going to have to do that again, hopefully. <laughs> okay, there's the ending. Finally! Okay, that jump took me like 10 minutes to even uh, understand how to do it. Oh no, it's Koala Kong. I'm, I'm, I was already frustrated because of the previous level. And now we got this guy. Go on, try that rock at me. I'll throw it right back. Boom! No, no, now it's over for him. Oh, oh bro. Oh, you hit the minecart. Okay, now it's actually over, finally. Ooh, watch out, there's a minecart coming for you. Goodbye, Koala Kong. And ooh, we made it to the third island, you know. Only a few levels left. So now I better pay very good attention and um, not embar 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 you know, embarrass myself. You know, good thing this level isn't too hard, you know. Okay, honestly, I think this this level has one of the best soundtracks. Like, the bass line is so good. And ooh, we made it to the end, you know. Th th this was pretty easy. Ooh, now we're in Cortex facility or something. I know. I got big Uka Uka mask. That's actually insanely useful because we can just speed run through it right now. <laughs> we've literally almost like made the level already. And we've, you know, it's been like 30 seconds. Wow, there we are. That was the quickest level I've ever played. I'm like so scared I'm going to die of some like embarrassing way. Like those bots there. I hate them. But I think we're almost at the ending, like just these few jumps. You know, there we go, and wh wait, why is this name so long? I don't remember that. Ooh, and this level is so easy, like I can do it in one sitting. And don't let that distract you of the fact that I've lost the mask. Ooh, we made it the ending, you know, that was pretty easy as well. But now here is Spinstripe Pot's Ruin, just because I've been salty the, salty the whole time, now it's going to be over for me. But right now it's going pretty well, you know, just wait until he starts swearing. And now we, we have to go, yes! I was, so, I was so scared that that was not going to work, but it did. And now this is where it gets real hard, because in my opinion the high ride is the hardest bridge level. Like, this is insane. Like, I'm surprised I didn't just get killed by that pig over there. You know, I hate these turtles, so I'm just going to use the ropes since uh, they've been working way better for me. I never understand how people do commentary on hard games because like, how do you not have to concentrate on the game? I knew we made it, no way, no, oh, that, that's amazing. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, Slippery Climb is like one of the easiest Crash Bandicoot levels. Like, how do you struggle in something as easy as this? I'm still debating on which level has the best soundtrack, but I think it's definitely um, Slippery Climb. I know, I do kind of hate this part. Okay, I, I, I did it either way. Just that section, that, that that's the hardest part of this level. And I think it's almost the ending. I think this is where the tree birds are. Oh yes, I, I, I literally recognize that. And wow, we made it. That was, this is generally my favorite level. Ooh, now for lights out. I'm probably going to die at this one because I always want to do this level too fast. And so far we still haven't slipped up, so you know, maybe... Just maybe this is going to go well. We're um, progressing, you know, this is a good thing. And um, my, my mask um, went um, gone. And no way, I made it without the light. No way, I, I'm, I'm insane. Jars of Darkness, you know, easy, easy level. And when I was getting the Platinum Trophy for this game, this is the last level I played. And that is mainly because I struggled the most here. And I remember when I was, um, uh, you know, when I was playing this, I was listening to the Born Again album from the Notorious B.I.G. That's kind of crazy because that's almost two years ago. Now watch me skip that jump. <laughs> no way. Please let me get through. I need to go to the ending. Yes! Alright, four more levels to go and um, cast some machinery. If you have the green gem, you can basically skip this. So if I die on this level, I, I could have been like... But I could have skipped this. You know, I love recommending people music, but then I hate when they don't listen. Like, I'd rather never talk to you again. Like, they'll be playing it for 20 seconds and then call it mid. Like, bro, you didn't even listen. 
I can't, I didn't recommend that song for nothing, you know. I don't know, I hate these boxes parts so much. But no way, no way I just said I hated it and died there. Nah, nah, this is the most, uh, like, terrible way I died in this game so far. Like, it ha this isn't even hard. Look at this. I, no, I'm I'm quitting. Oh, well, I wish that ended a bit better. And if I did have a death, I wish it would have been funnier. But um, does that answer the question? Can I beat Crash Bandicoot without dying? Um, no. Anyway, I guess that's going to be it for this video. If you enjoyed, please like, comment and subscribe. And turn on the bell. And if you want to see a video about if Crash Team Rumble is really dead or not, check out the video that will be in the end screen. And um, also check out the merch. And um, yeah, here's my outro. Goodbye.